The numbers speaks for itself. What a congregation is this? This tells me that the UAE and Dubai have done something right to bring all of you together in this place. And it gives me sleepless nights because the bar is so high that I need to surpass it. So ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, it gives me a great pleasure to join you here to commence the Jane International Trade Summit, bringing together business leaders, entrepreneurs, trade bodies, and government officials with a singular objective, promote economic growth, innovation across the region and the world, a goal which resonates strongly with DP World, JAVSA, and the United Arab Emirates. Our mission in DP World is to connect communities, ensure that trades, commerce flow smoothly and efficiently, foster growth and connectivity on a global scale. This reflects the core principles of Jane International Trade Organization, and it emphasizes our commitment to a world where trade flourish, supported by strong infrastructure and cutting-edge logistic technology. Early last year, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President, of the United Arab Emirates and ruler of Dubai unveiled the Dubai a new economic agenda called D33, outlining the economic strategy for the next 10 years. A goal of this ambitious initiative is to double the size of Dubai economy and to solidify its standing among the top three cities across the globe. To achieve this, Dubai is continuing to establish itself as an attractive business environment for both national and international investment, appealing to companies and talents from across the globe. At DP World, we are immensely proud to play a key role in this transformative agenda by fostering an ecosystem where entrepreneurs, companies from around the world can thrive. In Jabal Ali Free Zone, we have over 10,000 companies that call Javza their home. We have 1,500 Indian establishment called Javza a home. And we have seen substantial growth in 2023. And this is a testament of the trust, the faith that has been created between our two nations. Through Jabal Ali, we directly connected to more than 300 cities by sea, air, road, including more than 150 ports, which makes Dubai the ideal location for trade, manufacturing, and logistics. The growth is also being supported by the flourishing bilateral trade relationship between the UAE and key economies, such as India. The implementation of the Comprehensive Economic Partnership Agreement between the UAE and India has significantly boosted trade, investment, manufacturing between the two nations and the broader Gulf region, with DP World playing a key role as a logistic facilitator. This has resulted in a trade between our countries increasing to more than $84 billion, a rise that we have witnessed firsthand through the number of new establishments from India being registered in Javza, And with the additional free trade agreements that are in the pipeline, we remain committed to offering our customers new markets for them to flourish and grow. Earlier this month, we started laying the foundation of Bharat Mart, which was blessed by the Prime Minister of India and the Prime Minister of the United Arab Emirates, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum. It will be a mega distribution hub 
spanning over an area of 2.7 million square feet that will make Indian goods accessible to new terrain that are logistically unfeasible today. We want to complement Made in India strategy. We want to take We want to take Made in India to the world. We want to be part of India's success story. Another project that we are extremely proud to share with you that has been launched recently is the Agri-Terminal facility at Jebel Ali, which broke ground last week. It is a 550 million dirham complex will establish the largest multi-tenant facility in Dubai for storing, processing grain for domestic consumption and for export to the wider region. It will play, and India is a key partner in that project. I was asked earlier to give an overview of how the economy is performing. And I would like to tell you, gentlemen, there are four key figures that I would like to share, which truly represents how blessed we are. The first, Purchase Manager Index. Globally, the Purchase Manager Index stands at 49.2, which means the world is contracting. If you look at the UAE and the region behind us, around us, we are at 56. <laughs> Global inflation rate stands at 6.2%. The UAE is at 3.1%. The trade value have increased by 84%. We are now we have achieved 3.5 trillion in 2024. And finally, it is the GDP that is expected for our region versus the globe. So including India, and the UAE and the broader region, we are growing and expected to grow at 6.4, whereas the region around us is at 2.8. We're lucky to be in this world. We're lucky to be living in this region. We are lucky to be blessed with such a leadership. So let's cherish it and let's make the best of it. And God bless you. Thank you.